This display shows the SIMS Climate Digest for the Northern Hemisphere Summer, featuring highlights from the U.S. and global analysis products issued by NOAA. The Climate Digest conveys a visual interpretation of weather and climate conditions on a seasonal basis. The June through August 2016 average temperature across global land and ocean surfaces was 1.6 degrees Fahrenheit above the 20th century average of 60.1 degrees Fahrenheit, the highest temperature departure from average for June through August ever recorded, surpassing the summer of 2015 by 7 one-hundredths degree Fahrenheit. Furthermore, August 2016 marked the 16th consecutive month of record warmth for the globe. This real-time data set shows sea surface temperature anomalies for June through August measured by NOAA satellites. Blue colors indicate cooler than normal ocean temperatures, and red indicates warmer than normal ocean temperatures. Across the world's oceans, the June through August average sea surface temperature was 1.39 degrees Fahrenheit above the 20th century average, the highest for June through August on record, warmer than the previous record set in 2015. Summer 2016 temperatures for the contiguous United States tied with 2006 for the fifth warmest summer on record. Specifically, June was the warmest June on record, measuring 3.3 degrees Fahrenheit above the 20th century average. July was the 14th warmest ever recorded, and August was the fifth warmest since records began. The summer precipitation total for the contiguous U.S. was 8.92 inches, six-tenths of an inch above average, tying 1923 as the 24th wettest in the 122-year period of record. Of note, a persistent storm system dumped torrential rainfall across southern Louisiana in mid-August, causing catastrophic flooding. Precipitation totals over 20 inches were widespread, with localized totals exceeding 30 inches. Record flooding contributed to at least 13 fatalities. Louisiana set a statewide rainfall record for August of 12.91 inches, 8.27 inches above average. Meanwhile, the contiguous U.S. drought footprint was 19.5% at the end of summer 2016, with improvements in the plains, southeast, and midwest. However, most of California continued to experience extreme to exceptional drought. The outlook for fall 2016 indicates there is a 60% chance for above normal temperatures to continue over Africa, Asia, Eastern Canada, the Southwest U.S., and most of the Arctic Circle. Only the southern tip of South America has a chance for cooler than normal temperatures. Most of the globe can expect near normal precipitation, but the southeast U.S. and central South America should be drier than normal. Indeed, the United States drought outlook calls for drought to persist in sections of the southeast U.S. this fall as well as parts of New England and western U.S., including most of the state of California. And that's your summer 2016 Climate Digest. For more information, please visit the website shown at the end of this video.